The Moss Art Center projection mapping project took place in the interior stairwell inside the Moss Art Center over a long weekend. The unique architectural geometry above the stairwell appears like an upside down staircase. It was onto this feature I chose to project my animations. One Christie projector was placed on an 18 foot scaffold at an upward angle and the projection was bounced off a large mirror. The other Christie projector was set below to cover the ceiling above the stairwell. Specialized lenses on the Christie projectors cast light onto the ceiling surface at the best angle, determined using previously scanned LiDAR data. The animated light show was looped at 10 minute intervals. Tanner Up the Grove composed a soundtrack that was used for the piece, and temporary speakers were set up inside and outside the facility so viewers could see and hear the piece from several vantage points. By utilizing projected light and imagery, and complemented by sound, guests visiting the Moss Art Center experienced a study in aesthetic design that showcased the unique architecture of the building. This was the first projection mapping project on the Grand Stairwell location. The installation was for the public to explore free of charge. I have always been intrigued about the unique architectural form of this location and wondered if it was possible to project onto it. As the creative director and principal investigator of this complex project, my vision was realized after several months of laser scanning the site and making measurements to help aid projector alignments to hit all the surfaces in unison. The project went through four iterations with the Moss Art Center crew from helping design to fabricating the complex rigging, including at one time a 200 pound, 8 foot by 5 foot mirror to bounce the projection off of and onto the complex form. As creative director, I decided the animation needed to be simplified using color animations due to the angle of attack of the projectors. The project has had numerous showings over the past three years for certain Galleria, Moss Art Center, and Institute for Creativity Arts and Technology events. 